Morning everyone. I'm just having some breakfast. Uh, this is my gluten-free Nutribix and a teaspoon of xylitol. And then I'm gonna have a coffee, I think, as well, because I've got quite a busy day ahead. So I'm just sat replying to comments and having my coffee. I'm having it in my Benefit mug because after yoga tonight I'm heading down to London um, and I'm just staying in a hotel overnight so that I can make the Benefit event in the morning. Um, this was what their invite came in so that's going to be really exciting and obviously I will be vlogging it all here. But as for now I'm going to continue with my coffee and getting back to you guys. So I have literally just had the morning from hell. Um, I'm sat doing some admin work, waiting to go and get dressed, just like doing some emails. And I hear Lumi being unwell upstairs and she was sick. So I'm frantically cleaning that up. And then I hear the binmen come and they've just reversed into my, my car. And they've like, they, it's like all scraped up the bumper. I can't believe this. I literally can't believe this. I've never had an accident or anything in my life. No one's ever touched my car and now they've just hit my car. So the bin men are all here. And as you can see, they're all stood outside around my car. This is great. Just gonna take you out and show you the damage that they've done to my car. As you can see, they've gone up straight onto the bumper, scratched it all. Luckily it's still drivable, but I'm one of those people that's really weird about having things like not looking right with my car. And I feel like people are going to look at me like, oh, she's not a very good driver, is she? So, it is five o'clock and I still haven't had a chance to even shower. It has been an absolute nightmare of a Monday. Like, first, Lumi was ill. Then, obviously, my car got hit. Um, luckily, my dad and my stepmom came over to visit, which was really, really nice. But I actually don't really think I had the time to take out to, to just sit and chat to them, but I'm glad I did. So yeah, it's five o'clock and I still need to get to the post office. Um, I need to get washed um, and presentable because I've got yoga and then straight from yoga, I'm heading down to London. Um, that's the sound of Ali just getting home from work and I haven't even showered. It's a nightmare. Um, so yeah. I'm going to head to uh, the post office now to pick up some parcels and then I'm going to try and salvage what is left of my day. So I finally managed to get myself washed um, and now I'm going to dry my hair and put some makeup on um, before I head to the post office and then to, the, to, to yoga. Um, I've used a leave-in conditioning mask today. Um, which is the gold smoothing balm from Original Mineral. This arrived in my um, my post box the other day and I'd never even heard of it but I actually really really like this. It's, it feels so nice on my hair and it is exactly what my hair needed after those hair tongs that I used that didn't really uh, agree with it. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way so for anyone who's ever wondered what my natural hair looks like, this is it. It's like, it's not really straight and it's not really wavy and it's not really like anything, but it's quite puffy and large. I always feel like I um, take up too much space when I have hair like this. It's like, oh, look how big it is. <laughs> it's like a, like a lion's mane. But yeah, no, I can't deal with it when it's like this. I wish I could, because it would save me so much time. But yeah, no, I'm not fond of my hair. Oh, natural. Right, so as you can see, I didn't have time to do my makeup properly, uh, nor did I have time to do my hair. Um, I am ready for yoga, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the post office um, and pick up some stuff that's there. Um, I've got my suitcase out to pack, but I don't know if I'm going to be going, because... Lumi's currently at the vet. She's not been well again and oh, I just don't understand. Like she's, she seems perfectly normal but she was sick and she's just not got a good tummy and I just I don't understand. So I'm going to go pick these up, come back, hopefully she'll be home by then and then I can go to yoga and if everything pans out I can go down to London for this event but I'm just so worried. I'm so worried. Oh, 
car. <sighs> Looks so sad. How you feeling, Nums? So yeah, so she um she just said that um try and make sure she doesn't eat anything that she shouldn't. We'll yeah. Put back onto that diet where she just has the cans for the moment. Um, I can't really remember what she said. But basically, she's like, she has lost a bit of weight, obviously, because she hasn't eaten. But um, she was so annoyed, Bloomy was. Was she? She's like, I've never seen her face like it. She was like, like, evil eyes. So Lumi is back from the vet. She had to have an injection um, to stop her from being sick and she's now on some special food and she's got some medicine so she's quite poorly but hopefully she's on the mend. Um, now I have to get myself off to yoga because um, I promised myself I would not miss yoga anymore because I feel so much better when I do it so I'm going to go and do that and then depending on when I get home, I mean I still haven't even done my hair, it's ridiculous. Um, depending on when I get home I might go down to London, if not I'm just going to have to leave it until like the morning or something. I don't, I don't know, I haven't even packed, it's ridiculous. Oh, I hate it when days don't pan out how you hope they do, but today's been a pretty bad one. So this was the other foundation that I was talking about that I treated myself to the other day. I've already bought this foundation once and it is absolutely amazing. I use it in my... Um, everyday makeup video that I recently posted and this really is the most beautiful foundation that I have ever used it's like the only way that I could describe it is it's like cashmere on your face um, it's just so soft and it just looks so nice and bright I love it uh, all set ready to go to yoga I'm wearing my Jaeger um, puffer jacket a hob scarf Sweaty Betty top, which is just so lovely and soft. Uh, body science leggings and my waterproof emu boots because we don't wear shoes in yoga. <laughs> and my hair is an absolute mess. I'm all set for yoga and I've made myself a really nice warm uh, flask of caffeine free elderflower tea, which I get from Harrods, so I'll enjoy that on my way home um, to really sort of relax me ready to go to bed. So let's go. day. <laughs> so I've just finished up at yoga. I did the um, Energize and Restore class, I think that's what it's called, at the White Space in Stony Stratford. Um, if you haven't seen my blog post about the White Space Studio, you can see it on my blog, which is Um Little plug there. But um, honestly, at the beginning of that class, I thought that I was going to have like a heart attack. I don't really suffer that much with um, anxiety or anything anymore, like I'm kind of over it. The reason why I went through it was mainly because of worry and things like that. Um, but today has obviously been quite stressful, um, I've tried my best not to, to let it get to me all that much, but I, I can't lie, I felt like my chest quite tight and stuff like that. So yeah, I was. Uh, we started the class and I was just like, I'm not going to be able to relax in this there's no way that I'll be able to relax I'm way too like stressed and yeah by like 10 minutes in I was falling asleep <laughs> such a good class they do it at like quarter past eight until quarter past nine on a Monday and me and my friend Carrie go and it is honestly just so nice and um, yeah it's perfect to like go home and just chill uh, you can go to bed or whatever just relax it's so good um, so yeah I feel a lot better now I'm not sure if I'm going to make it down to London, but I'm going to do my best to, to 
get down in the morning um, and tonight I think I'm just gonna make sure that Lumi's okay and yeah I'm just a bit worried about her but apparently she's eaten something now so maybe she's feeling a little bit better but yeah so I'm gonna end the vlog here I think um, and I shall see you again tomorrow bye